the sun in the background, Ellie's in the riverbed. That's got to be... It doesn't get much better than that, surely. Now, I've had an incredibly epic week this week and seen many... I've been super glad for the Nkumas to get their meal. Very happy that we've been seeing so many Ellie's. I mean, leopards, should I say. Sorry, not elephants. And varying other animals. We had buffalo the other day. Unfortunately, one of those met a sticky end. But to have this kind of a sighting is just... It trumps everything. It is unbelievable and special. You see how he's smelling us? Very incognito. Well done. A little bit of spraying of dust. Wow. Imagine we could talk to him. I wonder what he would be able to tell us. Look at those eyes. I love the elephant's eyes. Earlier we were asking about what, one of my favorite things about elephants, and it's their eyes. There seems to be so much in their eyes. I don't know if it's expression or what the incorrect word would be, but there seems like there is something there. When you look at their eyes, it's not just a blank animal eye. It seems as though there's this analyzing of you and this thinking and this thought process that's going on behind it. And there's just something captivating when we get to look into an eye of an elephant and be able to see it so close and the detail within it and that beautiful amber color and those big wide pupils and long eyelashes. There's just something about it for me. And you can see. A little bit of secretion. It's, I think this bull's coming out of must. I don't think he's actually going into it. I think he's the opposite end now because he's not dribbling heavily anymore. I was just looking at his back legs and his secretion around his face. And oh, did you see all those veins? Well, that was well done, Seb. Thanks very much for that. The veins around his ears as he flaps his ears forward are unbelievable. Now let's see if he'll just flick his ear forward slightly. There you can see, look at all those big veins. That gives you an idea of how they radiate out onto the air and why it's such an effective tool to cool their body down. Incredible. Well, like I said, I'm going to sit here and just enjoy this because there's very few things in life that are as good as this. Oh, look at the size of him. But while we do that, I believe Tara's lions are deciding to embark on a journey through the innards of a buffalo.